Good morning everybody, how are you today? Ah, oh, I tell ya, our house today is using uh, between 900 and uh, 1010 thereabouts watts. There's our volts coming into the house, it's pretty good. The hertz, it's not too bad. Uh, a lot steadier than the ones coming off the main wire. There's the watts. There's our peaks for yesterday. And we go in here. You can see our peak watts. Now because I got rid of that computer and that computer used 700 watts um, plus when I was gaming. And uh, this computer I got now uses absolutely next to no power at all. You can see our peak watts were only 3,924. Um, that's capable of going up over 10 kilowatts. And you can see our peak amps was 60. Um, my system's capable of doing 150 amps plus at 48 volts. Uh, time of peak positive amps was at 8.20 in the morning. The sun was at an acute angle then. Uh, peak negative amps, which was at 1.21.55 a.m. this morning, was uh, minus 10.1. State of charge, 100%. The time we reached, state of charge was 10.56. Okay, just before 11, which isn't too bad. Isn't too bad at all. All right. Um, let's go up here. Have a look at the charts look like. Let's look at the battery for this morning. And we're looking at the 22nd, which is today. And you can see the battery uh, last night dropped down to 88 was our lowest, 88%. Okay, that's um, uh, 12, yeah, 12 dod. So that's uh, depth of discharges out of 100 was only 12. And you can see, indeed, we sat on 99 for quite a while and then we went to 100. Okay and our bank got fully charged and then dropped off and that's what it looked like with the batteries well it's not too bad um now currently outside it's uh, just over 40 degrees uh, in the office here it's 28.9 uh, according to that meter I've got the air conditioner and we're only using one air conditioner, uh, not the big one, just this little one. And it's set for 27, so it's turning on and off, on and off, on and off. We've got that fan there helping push it out around the house, into the bedroom, um, down the hallway, out into the lounge room here. I actually might turn this other fan on because it helps push it around here. Okay, but if we go over here, currently under the veranda, it's 36.2 and 28.4 out here in the kitchen area. Okay, and Ziggy's just put a nice cheesecake in, um, a homemade cheesecake into the fridge, which is lovely. And on the table there, I got uh, charge controllers and some of the meters for the tests. I've got more, like I'm still waiting for some more meters. That terrible noise you can hear, that's the Mr. Whippy ice cream van going down the street. And outside it is scorching hot and the wind is blowing in from the desert it's blowing towards the coast you can see it on that tree over there 
but yeah, she's a scorcher today, people. Um, I'd hate to be living in a city where it's all concrete and um, tall buildings and yeah, I wouldn't like that at all. Not at all. All right, so that's uh, just showing you a little bit how the solar's going because it's, it's rocking it, totally rocking it. Um, for this time of year, I'm well and truly over panelled. However, like I say, my house is panelled for winter, which means I've got all the power in the world during summer. Um, that's great. I'm going to wish us all a good Christmas holiday. Uh, like I say, if you're in Australia and you're, you're going out bush for the Christmas and Boxing Day and if you're staying out there for the New Year's, um, it, it is going to be a lot hotter. We are expecting to break some more records. So please just be careful. And if you're going to the beach, cover up uh, because you'll be burnt to a crisp this time of year. So remember, um, yeah, put t-shirts on your kids, t-shirts on yourselves, good ones that block UV, and use um, a really, really good sunblock on the rest of your skin. I know there's nothing better than swimming down at the ocean, but water doesn't stop UV rays, um, unless you're right underneath it. And yeah, I mean, I know when I was a kid, I think, you know, the parents would be sitting up there under their beach umbrellas. And all us kids, we used to blister. Um, probably which is why I'm having so much trouble with skin, skin cancers now in my later life. But anyway, that's my problem. Keep safe, everyone. Enjoy Christmas. Um, and have a great holiday and I wish us all a fantastic new year, whether you subscribe to me or not. It's just, yeah, just have a fantastic new year. Okay, bye for now.